All right, you all know we live in the city of rock and roll, and while the Rock Hall recognizes the great artists from around the world, what about the bands that are born right here in Cleveland? And they assume there are a lot of them. Cellar Door Records is a local record label that helps them grow and reach a larger audience. Joining us now, Justin and Ali Marker, co-owners of Cellar Door. First of all, thanks for coming in on such a stormy yeah. night. We made you it. You made it. We all did. right. Thanks for having and us. And you're here to tell us about the local bands and the local music scene here in Cleveland. What does your company do for them? So, um, in addition to being a record label, mm -hmm. um, where we work with um, a variety of a roster of bands um, to release their music, help promote it, book it, um, and manage them. We also work with a variety of different festivals in the Cleveland area. Um, we also book a variety of shows all throughout town. And then we also have an online arts and music magazine at CellardoorCLE.com um, where we cover music, but then also art and comedy and film. Wow. Um, Very expansive. Yeah. I mean, that's touching all the bases. Yeah. Is there a lot of local music talent here in Cleveland that you are helping? There is. I mean, it's the, the, the the music scene in Cleveland is very vast and it's very deep and rich and you know one of the things we try to do is kind of be a megaphone to get all that creativity that's happening here into the eyes of ears of the people that wouldn't normally associate you know quality with local music. So this weekend big event coming up weather looks like it's going to be a lot better yeah tell us about it. Yes yeah, so um, this is the second year of our music festival it's called Cellar Door Rendezvous. Um, we've got 18 bands over two nights Friday and Saturday night um, it's going to be great. It starts at 8 o'clock. Um, and the location? At the Beachland Ballroom and Tavern. All right. What does the future look like for artists that are trying to get a startup, trying to get a shot, and you take a look at them? What do you think the future looks like for Cleveland? Like? Right. Well, the good news is the present looks good. Mm -hmm. um, it, there, there are so many bands that are doing so many great things. And the way we see it is, you know, the community as a whole is so interested in local things like local beer, yeah. local Absolutely. restaurants, You're right. you know, yeah. Cleveland clothing. And why why can't that interest be taken in local music? So the bands are alive and well and doing a lot of great stuff. And we're trying to get people to pay attention. Yeah. What made you start this up? What made you do this? You know, this started a long time ago with um, Justin and his friend Rick back in 2002. Ten years ago, when we were 20 years old, we opened yeah. a coffee shop that booked bands, yeah. and then we ended up selling that because we were very young. And from there, we kept on wanting to do the business part of it and helping bands and taking them to the next level. Hey, great for thanks for coming in. Great to meet you. Yeah. Uh, once again, real quickly, this weekend, where and when? Beachland Ballroom and Tavern. Alternating both nights, Friday and Saturday night, starting at 8 o'clock. All right, cellar door. Well done. Thanks Thank for coming you. in again. Thank you. Thanks for having Good me. Good to have you. Still to come on the news at 7, this blast of winter weather has a lot of people talking. We'll see what the buzz is over on social media.